This is the Gens Weekly Recap presented by Rapid Hockey Academy. Here is Matt Sossler. Hey, Gens fans, and welcome to this Gens Weekly Recap. I'm your host, Matt Sossler. The NAHL Generals enjoyed a weekend off while the NA3HL Generals took on the New England Sharks and the Mass Titans. Let's take a look at what happened. The Generals and Sharks meeting for the first time since they met down in Texas at the start of the calendar year here. Oborn picks the pocket, finds Clark for the tough angle shot. That was Clark's 20th on the campaign. That would make it one to nothing in favor of the Generals. Just over 10 minutes later, same score. Puck eventually finds its way to Nick Ram, shoots, gets his rebound, buries it. That would make it two to nothing in favor of Northeast. They added seven more over the course of the game to capture the nine to nothing victory. A look at some stats here. Tyler Ram, two goals and assists. Braden Kennedy, a goal and two assists. Nick Ram, a goal and an assist. James Clark, Ben Pizzameni, Dylan Dent, Tyler Kaminsky, and Jacob Kaczynski, each with a goal. Jason Gratz, Nicholas Oborn, Peyton Felix, Deacon Moore, Sean Loftus, and Nolan Maruli, each with an assist, and Patrick Colburn with 20 saves. The next day, looking to continue their perfect record against the Sharks and to get the series sweep here just over three minutes in. Second star of the week, Jake Hazu snipes it off the draw. That would make it one to nothing. And 10 minutes later here, tied at one. NA3HL D-man leading scorer Deacon Moore is going to pick off the pass. He's going to shoot it and find Twine. That would make it two to one. And less than 30 seconds into the second stanza, Jen's up three to one. Hazu buries his second of the day. That would make it four to one. And 16 minutes later, Hazu takes it around and shovels the backhand home for his first hat trick on the campaign. That would make it five to one in favor of Northeast. They added six more on the day to take an 11 to three victory and the series sweep. A look at some stats from this one. Jake Hazu, three goals. James Clark, a goal and four helpers. Jacob Kaczynski, two goals. Braden Kennedy, Nick Ram, Tyler Ram, each with a goal and an assist. Tyler Kaminsky, Nick Racker, each with two assists. Peyton Felix and Deacon Moore, each with a goal. Sean Loftus, Sean Gordon, Ben Pizzamani, Nicholas Oborn, each with an assist. And the next day on home ice versus the Mass Titans, Tyler Kaminsky getting the scoring parade started early in the second period. That would give the Generals the one to nothing advantage. All even at one midway through the third period, Racker finds Pizzamani off the deflection. That would make it two to one in favor of Northeast. Mass got one late that forced the first overtime for the Generals on the old campaign. And no overtime games on the season, no problem. Felix here is gonna give and go. He's gonna get to the net. Tyler Kaminsky is gonna shoot it. Felix gets wood on the rubber and it goes in. That would make it three to two and give the Generals the bonus point on the day. They went three for three over the course of the weekend. The Generals outscored their opponents by a total of 18 goals over three games. Absolute domination from the NA3HL Generals over the past weekend. And a look at some stats from this one. Peyton Felix, the overtime game winning goal and an assist. Tyler Kaminsky, Ben Pizzamani, a goal and an assist each. Jake Hazu, Nick Racker, and Gita Shepard each with an assist, and Patrick Colburn with 22 saves. And this one going final on Wednesday. Here you see Deacon Moore fires and scores. That was off of a quality Danbury opportunity. However, the Generals fell in this one 4-1. to one. And now a look to the week ahead. The NAHL Generals will head down to New Jersey to take on the Titans. The last time those two teams met, they split the series with the Generals taking the finale 4-3. The NA3HL Generals will also be in action. They have a game against the Mass Titans as well as the Springfield Junior Hattricks. Don't forget to tune into my interviews with Captain Dylan Schuett as well as Generals forward Paul Minahan exclusively on the Northeast Generals app. That's going to wrap up this edition of the Gens Weekly Recap for everyone here at the Northeast Generals. I'm Matt Sossler. Thank you for tuning in and roll Gens.